In West, organizers and artists at the Brookside Art Annual, they hope the rain holds off. You know, they weren't so lucky this morning during setup. You can see heavy rain as they tried to get everything in place. The art show got underway in the last hour. An artist in her own right, she's just as good as Picasso, Emma James, live now. Emma, I understand they're prepared for whatever comes their way tonight. Yeah, what a compliment, Kevin. Um, it's beautiful out right now, sunny and warm, but very, very windy. In fact, this booth that is clamped down, like you can see here, just blew open from the wind. So that just goes to show you how windy it is. All of the booths out here are really secured and weighted down just to handle any severe weather that could come this way. Organizers say they really hope everything goes according to plan because not only is this an exciting year, but it's an important one too. Um, they're depictions mainly of uh, northern New Mexico, which is where I live. These original oil pastel pieces are done by Jennifer Cavan, a featured artist for this year's Brookside Art Annual. She's excited to be back in Kansas City for the first normal art show in several years, saying the pandemic has posed many challenges. It was a little freaky at the beginning when it was like, how long are we not going to do shows? And at first everybody thought, oh, a few months and then reality set in and I was like it's going to be a little longer. As show organizers battle a rainy start to the weekend, they're confident artist sales won't go down the drain. We're going to be open. So please come on down. Show director Donna Potts says the show is finally back to full capacity with 180 artists compared to 140 at last September's show. I hope everybody will support them because they've had some rough years during COVID. While the show won't have its big tent anymore due to costs, every booth is secured and ready should artists have to close down and leave their pieces because of severe weather. For artists like Kavan, the in-person exposure is exciting and crucial for business. My my existing customers were very supportive during the pandemic, but, um, you know, their walls get full over time, so you need to sort of cater to some new people as well. So I find that the shows are the best for that. And if you want to come out and check out the art show, it runs tonight until 9 o'clock, Saturday from 10 until 9, and Sunday from 11 to 5. Live in Brookside, Emma James, KSHB 41 News.